if you want to install outside LED in this board so you have to change also the resistance the LED is 2 volt 20 milli ampere if we drop 10 voltage on the tam here we get 2 voltage okay into the a standard law of mathematics if calculation you, this right side is in multiplication so it will come in uh, left side it will automatically go in divide okay. here we have 0.2 watt it means we can put this size of resistance hello everyone this is Ozil welcome back to my channel so in this video I am going to tell you how to find the resistance for LED okay if you have a meters and in this meter you lost this LED this LED get faulty so if this LED get faulty on the time check light will not showing and any light uh, means if this is the check light if 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 this LED is check light, it will check light will not show. If the, this LED is uh, uh, ABS light, it will also not glow. You don't know how voltage and ampere used in this meter. So, if you buy from outside market uh, LED and that LED, you know that LED voltage and ampere. So, if you want to install outside LED in this board, so you have to change also the resistance which use for drop the voltage okay so so how to calculate and how to uh, make a circuit with own okay so uh, just i am going to explain you each and everything and which formula are used in this e in this process okay so now if you if you buy a led like that okay and the led is the LED is 2 volt 20 milli ampere 2 volt 20 milli ampere if you buy uh, from aftermarket and uh, you know that the uh, the shopkeepers told you 2 ampere it will be work good working on 2 volt and 20 milli ampere on the time you have you have to find the resistance because you have a you have a 12 voltage battery and you have to glow you have to glow but it will glow on 2 voltage how to drop the 10 voltage so now i will just make a diagram like that okay you have a 12 voltage and this is the resistance and this is the led but you don't know which values resistance used and you know the led is 2 volt 20 ampere so this resistance why we using this resistance because we have to drop the voltage so how much voltage we have to drop we have 12 voltage battery voltage and led is we need 2 voltage because our led is glow on 2 voltage i will put here and the voltage will 10 volt how it's 10 volt okay so we have to drop 10 voltage we have to turn if we drop 10 voltage on the tam here we get 2 voltage okay so by dropping the 10 voltage we have we have to apply ohms law ohms law okay according to the ohms law v is equal to ir it means v equal to i into r okay so we have we have volt 10 volt and we have current current means the si unit of current is ampere so we have a milliampere so we have to convert on ampere so this is the very easy way to uh, convert if you want to convert milli to ampere you just divide by the thousands so according uh, you can use also the calculator so 20 divided by 1000 so you can see 0 0.02 ampere okay how much 0. 0 0.02 ampere current 0 0.02 ampere current will 
flu okay so i we will put so according to the a standard law of mathematics if you if your circuit if your uh, calculation this right side is in multiplication so it will come in uh, left side it will automatically go in divide okay so 10 divided by 0 0.02 so if you divide 10 divided by 0 0.02 so you you can get r is equal to 500 ohm so you got you got 500 ohm if you apply if you put 500 ohm resistance on the time you get here 5 voltage but the important is what which size resistance i have to put here which size it's a very important if you see that this size we called 1206 this is the resistance size and you can see here this one this one size is 0805 okay and this also here a small one is 0603 size okay and once once also half of this resistance its size is 0402 let me show here you can see here this this one this one size is 0402 okay and this size is 0805 so this is the basic basic and common resistance size used in this ECM this size depend on its watt you know watt so this uh, 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 this size watt is 0 0.06 watt and this resistance watt is 0 0.10 watt and this and this size watt is 0 0.125 watt and this size watt is 0 0.25 watt so according to our circuit according to our circuit we have to find we have to find the wattage of this resistance so we know that the uh, the formula of watt finding the watt is equal to v p p means watt power p is equal to i v into i okay v means voltage so we have drop voltage we have drop how 10 volt and we have current 0 0.02 if we multiply this one 10 into 0 0.02 we got 0 point, 0 0.0.2 watt okay so here we have 0 0.2 watt it means we can put this size of resistance the size of this resistance is 1206 1206 as you see here 1206 you can see here this is the watt of resistance and we uh, used here the size size of resistance 1206 so if you want to order to the shopkeeper you have to tell 500 ohms and size 1206 six if they ask you they ask you what is the code of resistance so you have to tell 501 size is 0 506 this is the most important okay so if you want to put here the resistance to glow the 2 volt led on the time you have to put 500 ohms and 0 0.2 watt uh, uh, 0 0.2 watt wattage resistance okay so uh, i'm going to explain one more example for better understanding okay 
so you can see here i have this and this led and both are connected in series both are connected in series so according to this i am going to uh, draw the diagram like that okay like that okay here is a two led 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 and the led led voltage is 3 volt and 25 milli ampere also 3 volt and 25 milli ampere the current will be remain same if if this circuit is connected to the series the current will constant and voltage will change okay so here we can see this is the ic this ic out ground for glow okay here you can see this is the ic and this is the two led and the resistance of two led is the the voltage of the two led is 6 volt 3 plus 3 if this uh, led uh, connected in series it means it will be added okay so the formula of series resistance means rt uh, series series formula s1 plus s2 v1 voltage plus v2 the voltage 3 plus 3 6 volt so we have load 6 volt okay and how much we have we have 12 voltage we have 12 voltage and we have a led of 6 volt so how many voltage we have to drop with this resistance 12 minus 6 is equal to 6 volt okay so we have to drop 6 voltage so how much value of resistance it will be there okay so now according to the ohms law we can find easily okay so here i will put ohms uh, sorry uh, ohms law ohms law is equal to v i r how many voltage we have to drop 6 volt okay so 6 current current means a current means what before i see you here here is the current milliampere here also 25 milliampere but here is a 25 uh, milliampere but we have current means current means ampere so we have to convert in ampere so you just 25 divided by 1000 110 so 0.025 into r so if you know that the right side of uh, this calculation is multiplication and if we will shift to the uh, left side it will be goes to divide so 6 divided by 0.025 is equal to r so i can use i can calculate 6 divided by 0.025 so you can see the r value is 240 ohm 240 ohm here we install to 40 ohm but there is also one questions so how many the size is what is the size of this resistance so how can we find the size according to the power so we have to put the power formula power is equal to v into i okay so v means voltage so here we have how many voltage 6 volt current we have 0.025 so if we multiply 6 into 0.025 it will be 0.15 watt okay so 0.015 watt here you can see this is the 12 0.12 it's the it's a 5 okay so i can put only this one also we have put same here also that's why in many leds we use uh, the uh, the engineers use this resistance the size is 1206 okay 
the resistance size is 240 this is the resistance 240 ohm and 240 ohm and the size of resistance is uh, 1206 so if shopkeeper ask you what is the code of resistance so you have to tell uh, 241 and the size 1206 I hope guys you get the knowledge from this video and uh, if you uh, didn't follow me on Instagram so please go and follow me on Insta link below in the descriptions and uh, um, follow on Insta and if you want to uh, um, know the pinouts of any IC and any ECM you can visit our website ramzon.in and you can also join our classes online classes uh, very, very easily just enroll the classes and pay and watch the videos and I have put it many hundreds of uh, wow video to, to diagnose and uh, calculate and uh, circuit whatever generally use for repairing so thank you